um, yeah, I'm on YouTube again, and just something unbelievable, I guess, because I haven't filmed for a really, really long time. So this kind of like intro talking video is gonna be on this really bad quality camera, but the rest of the video is gonna be really good HD camera. As usually, I do have a lot of stuff on my hand because I just finished doing all this makeup. And my friend Tim is like my best friend. He's in love with this actress and he was like, oh my god, I love her. And I thought I really want to film a makeup tutorial or outfit something on her, about her. So yeah, I hope you like it. I'll try to use like as less products as it possible only because I know that... You guys, when you watch videos, you really want to use it like in everyday life, not just night out or Halloween or something. So I try to make it as wearable as it possible. You can um, apply a less eyeshadow or not as dramatic liner as I do have right now. The way you want, guys, and try to create and be as creative as it possible. And if you still have any questions, so please leave it down below or on Twitter, Tumblr. This t-shirt is completely uncomfortable only because it's my, not mine my friend actually Zika she left it at my house and I really like it's like flowery and really light and very like positive it is completely uncomfortable I don't know the way how she can move like it looks like it's oversized but when you actually it's from Zara like really bad review stuff it's really uncomfortable. I don't know why, but I, I thought I really want to use it in this video. Yeah, I hope you like this video. So just keep on watching, comment, click like, subscribe, leave questions, whatever you want. And I missed you so much. And thank you so much for the support. Yeah, I love you. So just um, keep on watching. And if you have any other ideas or whatever, I don't have accent. I, I, I haven't filmed for such a long time and I'm nervous. And I guess that's why I speak so weird. Um, but yeah, I love you guys and keep on watching. Take your favorite base for the eyeshadow and I'm using Open Decay. Apply it on your both lids and also on your lower lash line. Alright, I don't have a perfect skin and I do have a little bit of foundation on my forehead. I'm using powder from Benefit which gives you perfect, perfect coverage. Don't forget to blend it all over your face so you will have even skin. With angled brush and a bronzer, this one from MAC, contour your face and apply bronzer. You can actually create a fish face to see exactly where you want to apply it and blend it to have a glowy skin. With a fluffy brush and a wood wing eyeshadow, apply it and blend it on both lids. With the angled brush and gel liner, this one is dark brown from Bobbi Brown, line your eyes. Take your favorite dark purple eyeshadow and a flat brush and apply it as close to your lash line as it possible. Today I'm using this pigment and it's from MAC Melon. In the corners of your eyes, guys, and underneath your eyebrows. Brush your eyebrows and fill it in with a dark brown eyeshadow. Last step for the eyes, so curl your lashes and apply your favorite mascara, this one from Victoria's Secret, like volume effect, remove excess if you need it. a 
natural but still bright lips. I'm using this lipstick and it's from MAC, please me, I'm using it all the time. Apply it on the back of your hand, blend it, and what's left on your fingers, this is actually a trick, apply it on your lips. You can use, actually use this lipstick and it's from Makeup Forever, it has a like orange tint in it, and apply it the same way. To give a dramatic look, apply olive color bronzy pencil on your lower lash line and on your waterline, like so. So yeah, hope you like it, and we actually finished, and I talk to you very, very soon.